Major in game 100. First at the Blues, finds Mackay. 2022, but 29 29 last season. Big kick for the Blues, big kick for the psychology of Mackay. Sam Doherty, he's all good. He's the player who's had far too much to endure. Kerno coming at this and not sure what was going on. He's kicked it away from him so he could go run and jump, use his athleticism. A... Wheel and go. Mackay comes at the ball. Andrews taking in a really strong Mackay tackle. Mackay into the path of Owies. All the momentum now rolling with Carlton. The good mark taken by Mackay. That kick was straight to the corridor to try and open the game up. Big fly, Harry Mackay! We've seen some magnificent examples in the last... Good contact. Straight as an arrow. Jump at the ball. And as soon as that came off his boot, he knew it was good. He put the arm up. He started celebrating. Gets it to Cottrell. Mackay out the back. He's got Cripps. He's got Cripps. And we've spoken about how big of a night Paddy Cripps is. As he's... He sends it in long. Mackay's the target. Got it! Mackay. Carlton fans can dare to dream. Can they bear to watch? Mackay! Mackay! He's done it! Clearing kick from Akers. If it goes out, he could be in trouble. Mackay did brilliantly. Gets the ball often today. I'll tell you what, there'll be a lot more money going because he doesn't miss out. Blues will repel. Harry Mackay. Pink High was... contact, Carlton. Goption. Play on. Getting involved was Luke McDonald. Strong tackle from Mackay. No free kick. Picked up by Durden and the Blues strike back. Era. Open forward line. Mackay's in the box seat. Core holding on. Holding. He looks set for a really big season for now, Charlie, Charlie. For three Carlton goals in a row. He looks a different man in front of goal this season, Harry Mackay. And whole bo ball movement is really stagnant. Touch, play on, play on. Works the one-two. He had a short one to Fogarty, and Mackay presents nicely. Dawson had his name written all over it, then had the Sharon's name written on his forehead. Mackay up again. Davies Uniac goes long. Pink in front, but Mackay. Play on. He goes deep. Mackay and Pink. Mackay, strong hands. His fluency, his rhythm. He's worked hard on it. Left post here. That is just glorious. Harry spreads his wings and celebrates his second goal. Working on this clearly, Harry Mackay. Some issues with his ball drop at times, 200 centimetres. Sometimes it can tip over a little bit, but that looked beautiful. Do you think there's a there's an element as well, though, when you're less anxious? Look at the field, and it just feels like a powerful outfit. To Cody, love that off the boot. It's given it a good ride, and McKay's playing like Peter Hudson. And this one is the snap as the right option, and he made it look easy. Harry McKay's got three. To Chera, where's the big forwards? McKay this time. You cannot defend that. Thank you, kick. Phil. Charlie Curnow, we're going to be a handful, and they've both got four goals, and there's plenty of time left. It's Cribs. Look at that space. Absolutely nothing Core can do there. He's looking up the ground going, come on, guys, we need some help here. Boys, <laughs> the Ferrari's in there. Sad to Mackay. Playing their role really well yeah. for the Blues now, and that's what... You know better than anyone, Danger, the good... In an area that, that North clearly have room to, to work on. Kai leading up, that's his ninth mark this afternoon. Defensively just lost a fair bit of shape behind the ball, North Melbourne. Kai, stand, play on. Matty Cripps. As you said, he has been quietly outstanding, if that's possible. Kurno out the... He's got it, a handful for Happy Harry. He's in the perfect place. Cottrell has a happy knack of doing damage up forward. And come up at Cottrell. And that just made it such an easy chip kick under. Williams, back to the wing. Mackay up yeah. the ground this time to give them a way out. Young. 
Again, Mackay just put bricks where he didn't want to be. To get it in the box there. Now, Mackay, he's done his best marking work up the ground. And he's been able to facilitate a way out for Carlton and to half forward. Pitnett plants himself. Kerno biding his time to make his lead. And it's Mackay who comes marching out, and that's much better. And he does. And Carlton are right in this one still. You hear me? It seems to kick through the ball a bit more, a bit more conviction in his kick. That's a great lead. Terrific pass, as I said, but that kick there. He's on. Look out. It's touch, so it's play on. Oh. Hindenburg did not realise, or at least that's the way he acted. He goes here, goes bang. Sorry, I've got a monster that's just ripped me as soon as. Advantage. How significant will that be? Walsh inside, not Mackay. Very Maybe big. it will be Harry. So two from Kerno in the corner, and now two from Mackay, and the Blues have hit the front. Lackley is stuck on the bench to in this seven minute patch here in the first from Mackay has been significant. Teammates, so Walsh pounces. Here's Mackay, prime position, and all out. All right, pit net or deconing. Instead of oh. Mackay, great tackle. Eight Carlton goals in a row. This game is on the edge now for the Giants. After due consideration. And then somewhere in between Carroll and the tackling of Harry Mackay. He's got a case for this now. Opportunity to score a goal late. Mackay will be told to settle. Kerno's at the back. I Cole Jasley was expecting contact. Frank defence in the comp. Oh, it didn't seem completely convinced about where to head, oh. but Mackay, wow. very viable option for him. He wanders off. And in the back of his mind, he had Ollie Hollands. The result, it's Wietering. To the extremities to Mackay and then to <laughs> but whatever it was, it was sensational, and we all need a bit. Fighting three blues, can they get organized? The fumble didn't help from Mackay, but he found a way back onto the footy, got himself set, and kicks the goal to lift the blues. Can't kick set shots, but they kick one on the run. Stanley realizing there was a small opening for him. That was the same that applied for Holmes. How's the up is everyone stopped? Wow. It just feels a bit wrong, doesn't it, Henry? Oh. you from getting to the next contest, it is. Yeah, so. but, uh, uh, well, they must have deemed he got a game high 19 point lead enjoyed by Geelong at the moment. Oh. Cameron more than matched by regularly one of the few that has had Tom Hawkins as measure over the last five years. Gee, they needed it. It's a big one on one win. No one was quite sure where it was going to land. Mackay, Guthrie, tracking it. Mackay feeds it through. Elijah Holmes took him to darn while to pick it up. But when he got there... Two goals, four for the quarter. Prime target was Harry Mackay. He escaped from Sam De Koning. And along the line, he goes for Tom De Koning. Pittnett's tried to up the danger by getting down there as well. You wouldn't go... Oh, look at that, it's Harry Mackay! The devil, the Blues in the first half. It's getting to that stage... Oh, everyone holds their breath. It wasn't convincing, but it doesn't matter. He's the one that got the body in the mix, put the hands up, judged it better, worked his way to the ball, worked a couple of them under it. And then it doesn't matter how they go through, as long as they go through, that's a good finish. Dagnett ahead. Overflowing with Geelong defenders. Mackay makes the move. In this ruck duel. So McCoy for Acres, quick release Hollands. Again, really nice, solid pair of hands. This time McKay. So some relief. Although only very momentary. The big soldo kicking up straight uh, back to him. 25 on the season for Harry McKay. He now has 26. Cowan did well. Again, the smother. So. Harry's got to work his way through a tackle, he did. He advanced Soldo and then had no intention of having a shot. Mackay. Players out here for the Blues if that kick works. Away from home, open forward line. The kick goes deep. Mackay! Single goal in each of his past three. He was averaging three game goals a game prior to that. 
It flirts with the right post, but he gets it home. Carlton back in front. The fifth lead change. I'm a gave it plenty. Kai. I reckon Soldo will need some help. Dixon worked easily under the ball there as Mackay kicks inside 50. Mackay, clean possession. That is it. Mackay to fly in from the side here. Good hands. As he goes for a bit of a trot. Now Mackay managed to get separation. This term, Chincotta. Akers. Mackay! Emphatic stuff. And sometimes you just got to be in the right position at the right time. And when you're a good forward, exactly as Michael Voss would want Newman into the corridor, out comes Mackay. In season 2024, just looks so much more confident with this part of his game. Good looking effort. Nailed at home. Mackay kicks the first. A little slider to half forward. Fogarty got it back to Williams, he's got Harry burning back to the goal square and an easy goal brilliant pass, Mackay's kicked the first two by Chera, got it back to Matty Kennedy Mackay is in good touch and it's like a magnet to him the Sharon. what a start this would be directly in front stabs it through, Harry Mackay has got three goals the challenge now is for the Giants just to hang in there. Got to make it an arm wrestle, can't let... Mackay into the ruck. Wrestling with Bedford, picks up the football, flips it in. After round seven, they look like the team to beat. And they found their feet again. Mackay started this game. Like you. Might work out OK for Newman. Pokes it down the line. Mackay tries to turn and is being held. And there has it. This one for a different reason. Get back within five goals. And he slots it. This shows the power of Patrick Cripps now. Not without a chance. And look at that kick. It's a 60 metre. So the forwards know exactly how they want it themselves and presented that perfectly for Harry Mackay, who's got. Are able to do that. McNeil, nice little pocket kick. And for Jerome, played on, he had no idea. Big Harry was just lurking. This combined, and again Walsh looks to exit. And hits Coffey. Yeah. Returned to the team last week. What a task he's going to have this afternoon. He just sends it down the line to McKay, who's been in everything so far as Harry. From McRae to Akers, another possession. McKay! He's going to come back with interest. Fogarty sends the ball deep, and Harry's miles out on his own. So his kicking boot has been on. And Harry is on the board, and the Blues have got the first three. Yeah, it's... obviously Carlton's pressure was good enough through the middle of the ground. Eight inside 50s, that kick three goals. Of his non preferred, Saar, it's dumped. It's going to be downfield. Clock's an issue here, but Harry thumps it deep. A late goal for Fogarty. Attack, but Walsh just going to get there as quick as he can. No, at the last moment, he saw the movement of Mackay. He was three shots for goal, only one so far. Just a couple of steps, but he knew straight away that that was right on target. Do a better job there to space themselves out. Beautiful technique this year, Harry McKay. Nice little charity option there for Tim Cotter, who gets it deep and again. Just... Yeah, Harry McKay looks like he's going to mark the ball. He's a massive threat. He's curled through his third. Ah, the Western Bulldogs key defender is going to be out. Now into the hands of Caulfield on his best effort. He turned it over to the after all that indecision, he spots Mackay, a substantial target. And on the turn, the Blues angle.